Dearly beloved, we're gathered here today in the sight of God in the presence of these witnesses to join together Justin and Jordan in holy matrimony. Jordan, I can't believe that our day is finally here. Today will be one of the happiest days of our lives. As I stand here holding your hand, I can't wait for you to see me when those doors open and I start walking toward you, toward our forever. I vow to give you my all, day in and day out. I vow to make my love for you so evident that you never have to question and that you know it's unconditional and unwavering. This is how it was all meant to be, you and me right here, right now. I'll love you forever, for the rest of our lives, until God calls one of us home. Love you. I love you, Jordan, forever and all. been a role model to me growing up whether it was if I had a rough day at work or just advice on who to start in fantasy football on Sundays but you've always been a good brother as good a brother as I could ever ask for you've impacted my life more than you could ever know and will always be my closest friend I promise that whatever Justin does he does it boldly and I've always looked up to you for that Thank you for all the laughs. I couldn't have imagined anyone better to be my sister-in-law than Justin's life partner. You two are going to create a lifetime of exciting and laughable memories together. All the best to you both. I love y'all. Oh, that's beautiful. May they seek your face as every new day dawns. I pray that they look to you for guidance and strength, not only in their difficulties, but also in their joy. By the authority granted to me as a minister of Jesus Christ, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Justin, you may kiss your bride.
Amanda, I love y'all. And good luck to Justin because you get to share a bathroom with her forever now. And not me. Praise the Lord. I love you both, and I pray that God will bless your marriage in the years to come, and I can't wait to see what the future has for y'all. Justin St. Ives.